Hi, I'm Noel Wiggins here with you guys on day three, giving you guys an inside look on Emma Shore's EY Partners press conference. Hi there. As most of you know, my name is Jack Ellis, and I'm the press secretary for Lieutenant Governor Emma Schroer. In the early 1900s, a campaign was started as a part of the YMCA to give scholarship funds to participate in different activities. At the creation of Minnesota Youth and Government in 1946, the YMCA started offering scholarships for those who needed them to attend different conferences. In the late 80s or early 90s, the name was changed to Y Partners. Y Partners, in 2012, gave over $60,000 to Youth and Government Model Assembly and other Youth and Government programs in Minnesota. This money has helped hundreds if not thousands of kids attend the different conferences offered by Youth and Government. Lieutenant Governor Emma Schroer has put Y Partners at the top of her personal agenda, along with Governor Elia Reed, as a way to give back. Lieutenant Governor Schroer's staff and cabinet will be in the Skyways during mealtimes to collect spare change and donations for Y Partners. Lieutenant Governor Schroer will be collecting um, money for Y Partners at lunch today. We encourage you to donate to Y Partners, whatever um, financial donation you can. You can find her cabinet and staff carrying water jugs to collect the donations in. Also, after the conference, um, you, can, you or your parents can donate directly to Y Partners um, with youth and government um, as they're um, being received. Emma? Thank you. When I was in eighth grade, my mom, or fifth grade, my mom was diagnosed with ovarian cancer. Because of her treatment costs, it was difficult to cover the cost of youth and government as an eighth grader. My parents believed that it was important for me to attend this, um, this conference, so we, we applied for a Y Partners scholarship. The scholarship co covered my model assembly tuition for both my ninth, er, eighth grade and ninth grade years in the program. I feel strongly about raising um, funds for this invaluable program so that other passionate kids like me can have a chance to participate. My staff members will be collecting donations today and I urge you to give as much as you can. This cause is near and dear to my heart, so please make this campaign the most successful yet. Thank you. I would now like to open it up to the questions. Yes? What are the criteria for receiving the scholarships? Um, you just have to fill out an application. Um, it doesn't matter where you come from. Um, they try and make it available for everyone. Yes? What programs do these wide partner scholarships help? Um, Model United Nations, Model Assembly, YCSI, and Conference on National Affairs. As well as on the National Judicial Conference, if necessary. Yes. Um, how many scholarships are currently given out? Um, there's not a complete number. What they try and do is look at all the applications and try and help as many people as they possibly can. <coughs> yes? Uh, does Y Partners only work with uh, you can government is to work with all YMCA programs. Y Partners is um, nationally run throughout all of the YMCA's, so it works with um, all different programs. However, if you donate here at the assembly um, today or tomorrow, or if you plan on donating after and you would like the money to go towards youth and government, um, Minnesota youth and government, you can write that in um, a little box when you donate, and um, it will go to youth and government. As I mentioned, 60, more than $60,000 were given in the last year. However, uh, we'd like to, um, in 2013, we would like the number to be even greater. Any other questions? All right, I thank you for your time. Thank you.
Hi, I'm Noel Wiggins, and I'm here on day three covering Emma Shore's Why. Hi, I'm Noel Wiggins with you guys here on day three. We just. Hi, I'm Noel Wiggins here with you guys on day three covering, giving you guys an inside look. Hi, I'm Noel Wiggins. Uh, here.